I got book 12 in the mail about cricket. Let me read, this. Let me read a little bit of the description. Growing in the heights, cricket has always had a million questions. Why are trees forbidden, even in art? Why do her parents seem to hate her? And the biggest, most dangerous question mark, why is cricket immune to Queen Wasp's powers of mind controlling? Spoiler this, by the way. And I'm just gonna start. I'm gonna draw a new drawing because this one's old. I'm gonna use HD size. And let's get to drawing. Let me draw and let me just talk. I haven't read the whole thing. I read a good portion of it. And I'm ready to talk about things that I don't like and don't like. That is the refrigerator in the background. Sorry. Let's keep on going. So, one thing I don't really, I do like, I mean, is that, um, the beginning scene, well, not really beginning, on page, like, 20, 10, where Cricket sees everyone, um, getting mind control, and she doesn't know her eyes are white, and she sees Katie, and she's like, what happened? I really like that. There's, like, sense of surprise, and we knew what was happening. But she did it, and I was like, oh, God, this is a good one. I like that part, right? That was one thing I do like. One thing I don't like, oh, and there's a lot of things I don't like. Is it on the page 30? Is where, um, I haven't read the fourth thing, let me just say. Is what Cricket asks, Sundrew, how did you get over here? How did you carry, um, what's he called, sword tail all the way back? He said, I'm going to ignore that question, and they didn't answer it. She had to think of something to reach something on. Hard, I know it's hard to draw books, but, I mean, make books. But she had to think of something. Oh, God, how could he carry? He's too small, right? And eh, let's just say, eh, let's just not answer that, right? I don't like that. I think she made she should have made an answer. My honest opinion. I'm just drawing a little bit of um the book, how I remember it. Well not really how I remember it. It's hard to draw, but that's just moving on. That's I really didn't like that. They could have explained but she decided not to because she couldn't think of something. I understand that. But if you're writing a book, make things that at least make sense. You know what I mean? Like, just don't do things that don't make sense. Or else your book's gonna be bad. That's basically it. Okay, moving on to another thing I really disliked about this book. Is the beginning. I really hoped, because in book 11, the epilogue, making sure my microphone's on um it showed luna right going to a different island and meeting moon and quippy now i skimmed through a little portion of the book um, i'm not that in i'm like 30 percent in because i got it today but i think we should have started off with that like cricket next to Luna or something, or forget about um what he, she called cricket and make the book about um Luna. Cause like you, you said in your epilogue that this is gonna happen. That's basically what's the point for epilogues. Am I right? Sorry, the brightness. I like it low so I can draw in the white screen. I didn't like that. I was like, why would you do something like that? That's so dumb. They should have put the beginning scene from the epilogue in the beginning of the book. Because that's what you advertise in the book. That's what you bring hype to. So why didn't we get it? I didn't like that. I didn't really like um, what she, she called. Another thing I don't like is um, what she called. Uh... Um, Cricket, Cricket, I forgot her name, backstory, it seemed kind of boring, 
She just liked books. She kept on wanting to know how she couldn't, and that's about it. I haven't read all the book, so correct me if I'm wrong, but that's about it. I don't really like that. I like really make her interesting, like Winter's backstory. I liked how he was disgraced. Cause like it was interesting, not just, oh, she has some weird unexplainable power. They haven't explained it to. I want them to explain it. Or are they gonna keep it a mystery? I want them to, to explain it though. That's what I want, Starry. You may notice some similarities to the book cover art, even though it looks nowhere near as good. I'm copying, I'm copying from it. Because the drawing's too darn hard. So, yeah. Oh, another thing. I don't really like that much about this um, book sequel. Is Este Crick? I mean, Sundu, how did he know she was going to be in the cave? They said he was at the bottom of the earth, so I'm expecting them to be in the cave. And 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 she, and Cricket even said herself, she went to hide with, because um, Blue just went into his metaphor, metaphor state. We turned into a cocoon. How would he know? I may be wrong, but how would he know? And how would he know even the exact same, exact place she's in? She just said, I want to be at the bottom of the cave. Shouldn't there be so much at the bottom of the cave? How should he know exactly? Oh, and I didn't like how they said someone else was in the cave. I was like, dun, dun, dun. But really, <laughs> just cricket. I was like, okay. I mean, I thought it was going to be something cool, like, um... Or evil high wing, but no. One thing I found good about this book was that they didn't just, that's too big, that they didn't just went, oh, okay, and what's he called? Um, um, Sundu beat the both of the high wings. He shouldn't be able to, he's only a leaf wing. I don't think he should be able to. That's just me. this i'm just okay i'll just stop this i think they should have been i think that's good though i like how they didn't do that they didn't say he won because i do believe high wings would absolutely throttle <laughs> i mean especially if there was two um throttle of sundu you know one thing i did like what well, kind of didn't like no, I didn't like, I didn't like this. Was, how was I said? Luna drifted into the sea. Like, oh, you know what's gonna happen? She's gonna go to Moon and, um, Dribble and Cribbly. Oh, I can't say his name right. And just tease you like, oh, it's gonna come. But not yet. Like, really? Come on. Serious, I wanted to come now. And you're teasing me. It's not cool. I didn't really like that at all. Sorry. Like, seriously? Not cool. You're just gonna do that to me? Sorry, I'm just paying attention to this. I also kind of liked... I mean, I didn't like the part where she said... Oh god, I don't have space to draw these. Hold on. Give me a second, I'm gonna get a little bigger. Oh, oh no, sorry. I'm just trying to get a bigger format. I'll keep on drawing in a second. Just keep on, I guess I can go. I didn't really like how she said, um, her only regret was that she didn't bring a book. I mean, don't you know you have a sister that you said you liked? Um, don't you care about her? Didn't you think about her before you left? And I didn't like how she liked 
um, the blue. I found that really bad. Like, no, I don't really like that. I don't like romance. I just don't find it weird. Yeah. Um. Hopefully this video will get someone who comments. Whatever. I don't care. All right. Let's keep on talking about things I don't like about this book. I don't really like the part where, um, what's it called? Cricket just was daydreaming. We found out a little bit of our backstory. It was like, hmm, and next to Blue's cocoon. I was like, I want to get into the action. What's going to happen? Hurry. And they made me wait, which I didn't like. I need more space. I'm just gonna draw this. Yeah, I'm gonna get another um, picture. Back to my gallery. Cancel. I really didn't like that. I think they should have um, wide and height. <laughs> Make it ginormous. Okay, this is pretty big. I think they should have. Um, not made her daydreaming and just got right into the action because i was like suspense like what's gonna happen i want to see and they just like went um no just have this little bit of backstory and then we'll tell you i didn't like that i was like really i don't like that by the way just to let you know i was like hmm a little mad about it but yeah i'm fine right. i'm only like 20 percent into this book but I'm hoping that it will be better. This is not going to a good start with me. It's okay right now, but not good like book. Like my book six started with for me. I liked book six. I know I said I don't like it because now that I realize it was kind of bad in story and stuff. But it started me out with like wondering, what the hell is this gonna happen? There's a character in a rainforest. My camera, my glitchy glitch, glitch, glitch. I was like wondering, what? Yeah, I I hope they could do more with um, what's he called? Her character. What was his name? I'm day talking. All right, though. I'm only a big portion in this book. Oh yeah, I was talking about Moon in Book 6. I like how that she just went into the rainforest and no one knew who she was. She was random. It didn't really work out for me, but I still liked it. Because, like, I felt bad for her. Her parents were gone. And I was like, that's pretty bad. I feel bad. And then, like, right here where I just feel like, really? I don't like this. I don't even like the backstory here. And I have no liking of the way it started. I want to see what the action started. It was going a bad start with me. I'll do a part two. And I'm probably going to be around page 130 or something. I'm, right, or I'm like, I'm pretty in, but not too in. You know what I mean? So don't take any of my words serious, I guess, for right now. Just know that. I don't, I'm into a bad start with this book. It's not going good for me. I really do want to see it do good though. That's just me. Anyway, I think I'm gonna end this. I'm just gonna finish this quick drawing and post it a little later.